let's talk about my mother-in-law. I love my mother-in-law. She's a great lady. Great lady. It's just, you know, we're different. My mother-in-law's. We still bond just differently. You know, you and your mother-in-law might go shopping. I just give my mother-in-law a ride to the store. I can't keep up with her inside. She's way too fast. Whenever we're in the car together, I always make sure like a decent song's on. Nothing like hood rap. Yeah, we bond by like picking green beans in the garden. You know, you guys go out to eat, we're gonna go harvest. I feel so bad for my husband to go from Amish homemade cooking to me. <laughs> wow. Yeah, you think you have a lot to live up to. Like, I just got here, so yeah. That's where I'm at, microwave dinners and frickin' bullshit. <sighs> she doesn't really always understand my jokes, which is fine. I made a joke about holding the steering wheel at 10 and two and she didn't get it. But um, if I have to be in an Amish wedding, bam, I got my own stylist. I pick her up and we go to a little like Amish in the middle of nowhere fabric store she's taught me how to make homemade um amish soft pretzels that'll knock your socks off on any given tuesday yeah i get pretty self-conscious when she's gonna come over i gotta hurry up and clean up all them dust mites ah. before she comes over and like really cleans up my house she runs out to her phone shack and if i miss her call she just leaves me you know a voicemail of everything she has to say because if i call back she's not going to be in her phone shack to answer so she just lets it all out whenever i go to her house i make sure to go out to the barn and show their car some love give it some apples which i guess is like equivalent to her coming up to my tahoe and giving it a big hug in the rear I always get super concerned when she uses my microwave to warm up her coffee. Whenever I say something borderline inappropriate, she always just laughs and goes, oh, Jonna, but really I think she wants to take me to church. On October 24th, she asked me what I was making for Christmas dinner and I looked at her and I said, Martha, it's October 24th. I don't even know what I'm making your son for dinner tonight. Your mother-in-law might enjoy um, a night out. My mother-in-law calls me and asks if she can clean my windows. Well, help Martha, get on over here. Oh wait, I gotta pick you up. I'll be right there. She cleans my house. Like, y'all got nothing on my M-I-L shit. Shit.